Welcome back. Many nonprofit organizations host huge fundraising walks every year. The current situation is making that a real challenge. The Crohn's and Colitis Foundation is hosting the Take Steps virtual walk. And here to discuss the event and how it's being recreated online is Casey White with the Crohn's and Colitis Foundation. Casey, it's so good to see you. Thanks so much for being with us. Good to see you guys too. Thanks for having me. Yeah, so if Casey looks familiar, it's because she used to work at TMJ4 <laughs> under her TV name, Casey Geraldo, and she's now with the Crohn's and Colitis Foundation. Uh, Casey, so explain, how is a walk going to happen virtually now? Yeah, so we've had to get creative. We can't get people together, especially in our community. Um, a lot of our Crohn's and colitis patients may be vulnerable to COVID-19. So we had to adapt. And what we're going to do is bring people together in an online community so that they can still feel that support so that we can still fundraise for this really, really important mission of supporting research and supporting our patients um, without risking you know, continuing this COVID-19 spread. Casey, how important is uh, this particular event to what you, the important work that you try to do throughout the year? This is one of, this is our biggest fundraiser for the Wisconsin chapter. So, you know, knowing that we can't do it in person, we really need to continue fundraising. Our research is in je jeopardy. Um, we don't want to lose the momentum that we've built toward finding cures for these diseases that impact 3.1 million Americans and about 50,000 people right here in Wisconsin. So if we couldn't have this event at all, we'd really be risking some of those important efforts that are being made. Well, Casey White with the Crohn's and Colitis Foundation, thanks so much for joining us this afternoon and best of luck for to your event and uh, good job being creative. And we'll see if we can get some, some more people out there for you. More information about the event is up on our website right now. You can access that at TMJ4.com. Just look for it in the links section.